Earlier this month, a judge blocked Mayor Michael Bloomberg's plan to prohibit certain types of New York establishments from selling sugary drinks of more than 16 ounces. It was a plan popularly known as the soda ban. The Supreme Court judge has overturned Mayor Bloomberg's ban on large sugary drinks. The judge said he made his decision after testimony from a prominent physician. I believe it was a Dr. Pepper. If I'm not mistaken. <laughs> For now, Americans can drink all of the sugary sodas we want to, but according to a study released this week, we want to a little less than we used to. According to Beverage Digest, consumption of CSDs, carbonated sugary drinks, has declined for the eighth year in a row. <laughs> now we still drink a crazy amount of soda, 701 eight ounce servings per person per year, but that's the lowest that number has been since 1987. The decline would be even steeper if not for the success of carbonated energy drinks like Monster and Red Bull that are counted in the same category as soda. Energy drink sales continue to rise. Coke is still by far the top soda brand with Diet Coke, Pepsi, Mountain Dew, and Dr. Pepper rounding out the top five. Overall, we are still buying more bottled drinks than ever before. Bottled waters and teas are picking up the slack. But based on these numbers, it looks like the soda bubble may have popped. Nailed it.